Hello everyone, today we learn how to create analysis and design of a spiral stair. In a spiral stair we use to create this modeling stair editor. Let's start. Hello everyone, welcome to the Stat Pro Basic to Advanced Full Course Tutorial Series. Let's start. Run Stat Pro V8i. Click new project space and the title is spiral staircase. We choose unit meter and kilometer. Next, you go to the stat editor directly from here or by the inside. Finish. Editor is open. Close the editor. You can go to the stat editor from here. Restart. We want to make spiral staircase like that. Like that spiral. If you see here, here one joint and here one joint, and translate this joint in circular 360 and equal spacing and with direction of y these beam translate in circular path with the increment of y how to do this very easy go to the stat provider input with 79 enter and type joint coordinate and cylindrical reverse enter joint number one and x direction at y one meter zero and zero what is the meaning of this joint number one in x direction at 1 meter and x y is 0 and z is 0. This is x, this is y and this is z and this is node number. Okay. If you save this editor and check shift plus kiss k this is the joint if you select grid now you check the position of the joint this is the origin and this is 1 meter we type 100 0, 0. 1 meter in x y 0 z 0 ok again go to the editor comma comma is very important 24 space 1 space 3 space 360 what is the meaning of this 24 1 3 and 360 24 means joint number or node number first we create joint number 1 now we create joint number 2 okay. at 1 meter same as first 3 meter in y direction in y direction is 3 meter this is the joint and this is 3 meter and this is x from x this is 1 meter ok 360 means we create first node at 1 meter 1 1 0 0 and this 360 means he repeat 24 joints at x at 1 meter and y at 3 meter around 360 okay let's check save close check here if you go to the top view or front view and grid also activate Okay, check here. 
this is for joint number one at one meter from x and y and z is zero joint number two is also at one meter is look like is no less than one meter but it is moving z direction if you go to the top view you check all nodes all nodes is one meter from zero this is one meter this is one meter and rotate 360 around this origin with one three meter of y repeat the last joint is joint number 24 check joint number 24 okay we one more repetition we create one more joint and this repetition what we do we enter joint number 25 at 3 meter and 0 and 0 comma joint number 48 3 meter in x 3 meter in y and 360 rotation and close it's done what we do we create this at 1 meter okay one more okay we create this this is distance from x is 1 meter and this is distance from 3 meter because we want to width of the stair is 3 meter okay let's start like this first line uh, this is first line create this and second line create this okay now what we do by um, keyboard arrows rotate this like and take plate and select plate like this again rotate by arrow now you understand how to create a spiral and how the stat editor is work follow this step at the top This is your spiral stirrup, spiral staircase. The next step is for FEM analysis, we generate mesh, select all slab and right click, generate plate mesh and OK, quadrilateral like this. next step is provide support go to the top view we have to provide support all outer and inner joints first we create support fix select the fix support now
how to select this joint easily how what we do we go to the control Z Mm, and go to the top view if now I am select we create fixed support and we I, I think we apply fixed support only these joints the main joint and also on this side Now generate massing. Done. Next step is provide thickness. Go to the property. Def sorry. Go to thickness. We provide 200 mm thickness and assign to view. Next is load. Select dead load. and live load in dead load we select sulfate as well as floor load minus 1.5 floor finishing and steps and assign this load to whole stair check the direction is y close and assign in live load we take the live load minus 2 in the y direction and assign this go to the load and definition and automatic make load combination the last step is analysis Check uh, stresses in post processing due to live load. This is the stresses due to dead load. This is the stresses, and this is due to combination. check deflection this is deflection and animate this deflection like this okay so this is the is spiral staircase and design uh, uh, like previous video slab design if you like this video share subscribe and Click on bell icon for future video tutorial like ETAP, Revit architecture. After this stat, I finished this stat tutorial for series in 2-3 days. After this, we start ETAP tutorial series and after ETAP, we start Revit architecture tutorial series. Thank you.